State. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we start our day with a mixed bag. The mix goes like this. The Dow's up 193, S&P's up 10. NASDAQ and Russell and semis are trading to the downside. 31, well, basically flat for the Russell. The semis are off 42 points. Trannies are up 150. Gold's up about 10 bucks. Silver's up two pennies. Lights be crude trading out a buck. Natural gas off 11 cents. The 30 year Treasury printed out at 118.17. That's up 50, half a point out there. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini, left hand side. Yesterday, the ES Mini negated its Rhodes Mintum indicator top. Price is trading above, uh, just slightly above yesterday's high. It's trading above profile. It's trading above its green oscillator and change line. Conditions here are outright bullish. Now, they get outright bullish if we see a close today and the spot volatility below its 50-day exponential moving average. It is not right now. The 50-day is at 1390. Price is at 1403. Why, oh, why, and that's somebody inside the Tiger's Den, why, oh, why hasn't the spot volatility gotten below the 50-day exponential moving average? I don't know the answer to that. Typically, any rug pulls would be to the downside. If, of course, all rug pulls would be to the downside. If we take a look at the NQ, the NQ still maintains its roads momentum indicator top. In order to negate that, we need to see a close above 18,12150. U.S. dollar index, it's been... A wild week out here, but that wild week has really just been a consolidation with inside the profile support and resistance level. Support being down at 103.66, resistance 104.42. That consolidation with inside the U.S. dollar index has led to a consolidation with inside its profiles for silver and for Goldilocks out there. If we take a look, lights we crude rejected the top of its daily profile. If you can't bust them to the upside, we are trading just slightly below yesterday's low. Perhaps price wants to bust it down, bust it to the downside. In order to do that, we'd see a price move down to the 73.15 type area out there. We need to look, take a look at the intraday chart to see what's going on. Natural gas has got to buy the D point pattern out there, closed above the top of its daily profile yesterday and the day before, a signal of a profile change in trend. However, yeah, Lee Corso is in the room and he's saying not so fast. And the reason is because price right now is back inside that daily profile, 1.754. As long as that condition remains, you could see a test of profile support at a buck 67 and the 30-year treasury it's just got a new profile no bottom pattern or anything bullish in structure likely we're going to see it move up to the 119.03 area folks please stay tuned for the trader's Z show but if you have to start your friday have a fabulous have a fantastic one and we'll look forward to speaking with you again on monday take care now